Hi, Kenji here and today I've got with me Nicolo. And today we're here to build software for smart glasses. I think of ideas the best when I'm taking a walk out here in the park. And I realized that ChatGPT is a tool that's very popular for this nowadays. I mean, you can do anything with ChatGPT. But what I realized is that using ChatGPT on your phone while taking a walk is a very distracting experience. I mean, just imagine taking out your phone and looking back and forth while you brainstorm. And what I realized is that you can't really do that efficiently. So today I'm here to share with you about an alternative experience using ChatGPT on this pair of glasses. Over the past couple of weeks, I've been working with Team Open Smart Glasses to bring the ChatGPT experience to smart glasses. Now I bet you're wondering what these glasses can do. The first one is question mode, which allows you to ask one-shot questions to ChatGPT. So you can imagine like taking a walk and whenever you have a question, you can say like, hey computer, and you ask a question. The second thing that we can do is conversation mode, which allows us to have that same experience that we have using ChatGPT on the browser, but on our smart glasses. So imagine talking to ChatGPT and you remember the, the previous conversations that you've had with it. And the third thing that you can do is called listening mode, which allows you to record your conversations with the people around you. And you can chain that feature with question mode or conversation mode to ask more questions or do certain actions from your conversation. Hey guys, so now we're just at an empty room trying to film some demos for smart glasses. Hi everyone, let's start rolling. Hey computer, listen. So right now, we're basically just having a conversation on whether or not we should pursue a master's degree in machine learning and basically just giving points on why we should do one or why we shouldn't do one. Now, this conversation is going to be a bit long, about five minutes. So I'm just going to fast forward it to the end and see the summarization results. Hey, computer. Question. Summarize the conversation we just had. So we didn't get to record the results live on camera because Nicolo is wearing the glasses. But I just wanted to show you anyways what it looks like inside of the glasses. And this is it. As you can see, it's basically just chunking up the message into small enough chunks that can be displayed onto one screen and just displaying them one by one. It's not perfect yet, but right now, I think it gets the job done. And we also tried doing things like having conversations with ChatGPT while we are walking. And even though I may look like a fool here, I really think that having ChatGPT right up your face really helps enhance the experience compared to having to take a look at your phone back and forth. And yeah, overall, I just had a really great brainstorming session with ChatGPT. So I just came back home and I wanted to showcase more about what the AR display looks like inside of the glasses while using the app. Let's try having some conversations with ChatGPT on our glasses. So to do that, we say, hey computer, conversation. Tell me what is the future of smart glasses and why you think so. And you can see it's actually going through like a bunch of different text screen by screen because the answer replied by ChatGPT is kind of long, so it's actually just chunking up the replies into small chunks and displaying them screen by screen. Alright, there's one more final feature that I really want to showcase and that is how you can customize your chat experience using the system prompt setting. So if you open up the Glasses GPT app, you'll see a field for system prompt and you can change it. And using this setting, you can create, you can do a bunch of stuff like creating a persona for your chatbot. For example, ask it to act as a teacher, a vocal coach, or act, ask it to act as someone famous, like Elon Musk or Shakespeare, for example. Or you can really use prompt engineering to create simple programs using just natural language. So some examples I've in, I have in mind are creating a filler word counter, like to count the number of filler words that you use on a daily basis, or it could be something like a program with a simple rule based system, like a system that awards you points for talking about productive topics and deducts points if you're not. There's a lot you can do with this setting, so I highly encourage that you all go and check it out. 
and yeah, that's all we have for Glasses GPT at the moment. There's definitely more features that we're working on in the pipeline. While we wait for those, feel free to give us some feedback or tell us what you think about the app through the Discord or just opening up a discussion or issue on the repo. Contributions are always welcome. If you have a feature that you're, you think will be useful for the app, feel free to open up an issue and we'll take a look at it together. And that's all for the video. Hope to see you in the project.